In 1989, only 9% of Western Engineering's graduating class was female. Last year, 22% of graduates were women, a slight increase from 25 years ago. Traditionally, elementary and high school girls haven't been targeted for that field. But a program that started 10 years ago has done its small part in changing engineering's demographics. Jeremiah Rodriguez has the story. Grace Payne is putting the finishing touches on a drawbridge that she helped design. The eighth grader is doing the same thing as 40 other teenage girls in this room. Despite each group of girls starting with the same materials, each of the drawbridges ends with a unique design. This is one half of the bridge. Grace is here because she already knows what she wants to do with her life, become an engineer. I just want to know how things work. Um, <laughs> I like experimenting with stuff. Um, I want to be a chemical engineer, so I want to know how chemicals work and how they can make stuff. You know. The goal of today's outreach at Western is simple, to inspire more girls like Grace to go into engineering. There are more than 80 attendees for this year's Go Eng Girl event. Now some of the mentors in this room actually came to this exact program and are now offering their expertise and knowledge to the next wave of engineers. I had a hard time early on. In the other room, one of those mentors is second year engineering student Alex Matias. She's helping these girls to protect this candy in a popsicle stick safe like this one. It'll use a battery to power a red LED light once a circuit of the safe is complete. Alex remembers when she was once in their shoes. I had no idea about engineering back then, and I don't think that any of the girls here really understand what engineering means. Okay. So I just kind of want to help my kind of past self with uh, what, what it's going to be like. And these are like small little projects that they can do that are maybe like a micro project compared to what we do. Before the girls leave, student engineering clubs try and show just some of the avenues that engineers could take. From programming to robotics, green technology to amputations, engineering touches every facet of society. Professor Ana Luis Trejos remembers being the only girl in her graduating class. She says the problem is that girls could have misconceptions about what engineering is. A lot of the ideas of what engineers do is that they're going to be um, working inside a car or fixing a motor or that they're going to have to be up on, on a bridge wearing a, a hard hat. Um, and those are, might not appeal to a lot of women. But that's not what engineers do. Engineers do all variety of jobs and it's simply that engineering prepares you for a wide variety of jobs. One day, girls like Grace will hopefully find herself as part of a mosaic of young women who will and are shaping the world, one design at a time. Jeremiah Rodriguez, Western News, London.